I'll tell you what, we had temperatures in the 60s today, actually getting close to 70 in some locations. We had a few showers and some thunderstorms that quickly moved through early this afternoon. They're right now down the uh, Jersey Shore. We'll show you that on right on one second. But the big story, cold air. Some of the coldest, well, some of the coldest air for April anyway moving in. Maybe some near-record lows coming up tonight with the winds. Uh, you can find the winds and the temperatures tonight. It's going to feel around zero by late tonight. Let's check out the latest radar now as we speak. I'm and loading the latest right now. Hold on. Bill's loading up the radar right now, so we're getting the very latest for you. So that's why uh, you see us in kind of a frantic pace. But radar showing most of the showers now east of the area. The cold air is beginning to move in. I've noticed the front has moved through Harrisburg. It's through the Poconos, with temperatures now down into the 30s and the 60s here. But by later on tonight, readings will be dropping down into the 20s and uh, maybe even a few isolated upper teens up over the mountains. But we'll have more details of the uh, freeze warning that's in effect, the gale warnings as this uh, really brutally cold air for this time of the year is just about to invade the Delaware Valley. More in just a little bit. Janet? All right, forewarned yeah. is forearmed. Mm -hmm. Teamwork in the weather center there as well. That's right, and as that wintry blast barrels its way into town tonight, how will your tender flowers and blooms survive? Well, coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, find out exactly how to protect your plants from this upcoming bitter cold. Now drivers get the cold shoulder and the eight-day-old septa strike rush hour is thrown into